Yes, I have a word of encouragement for you today. Real quick, the power of life and death lies in the tongue. That's right. God told me to tell somebody, watch what you are saying. Watch what you are saying. You know, words are things in seed form. Let me make sure I said that right. Words are things in seed form. It's like in the natural, it's a seed. You want a cherry tree? You 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 take that seed and you put it in the ground. Cherry tree, apple tree. You know, you take it and you put it in the ground. And then you water it and nourish it. And then boom, it comes out a big old cherry tree, a big old apple tree. That's how it is in the spirit realm with your words. Your words are things in seed form. You take those words, you take that thing, and you put it in your heart. And in your mind, and you meditate on it and speak it and speak it, and then it comes to pass. And then, boom, there it is. So if you're sick, get some healing scriptures and speak it every day and meditate on it every day and work on, on it and, this, and work toward it, put forth some action, and then, bam, your body will be healed. You tired of being broke, disgusted, and can't be trusted? Then get you some scriptures on money, on finances. And meditate on that thing and speak it and speak it. And once it drops into your heart and mind and meditate on it, meditate on it. And then, bam, it will come to pass and you will no longer be broke, disgusted, and can't be trusted. You'll be rich and highly favored. You just have to get the scriptures that maintain your issues and meditate on it and speak it. And it will come to pass. I guarantee you that. Your words are very, very powerful. Watch what you say. The power of life and death lies in the tongue. So it don't matter if your kids acting crazy. Don't say, oh, them kids acting crazy. Oh, they just terrible. They're getting on my nerves. No, 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 no. That's when you grab them scriptures. And grab those scriptures in the Bible say about your children. They should be a blessing among you. The Bible says that. You better see what the Bible says about your kids and don't let the world tell you what your kids is. No, 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 no. Speak the scriptures that contain your issues. Meditate on it. Speak it every day. Work toward it and it will come to pass. God bless you. Watch what you speak.